What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today we're working on my Evo 10 and I told you guys I expected there to be a lot more content of us working on this car but Devin actually has been working on this car all week long and we are ready to do the first startup today. So we decided to go with the purple and it's also gonna go on the brakes. Right now they're just, the calipers are just red. But he repowder coated this so it's like this lollipop purple from Prismatic Powders. And this is the old color so they're super similar. This one's just a little bit more poppy which I absolutely love. What do we have to do to get it to run today? See that oil cooler? I have to install that. I have to install intercooler and piping. Fluids, prime the oil system, fire the son of a bitch up. All right, you guys heard the man. I'm a, I'm a little out of it today, you guys. I'm pretty tired. Also, just everyone watching Bobby's channel, read my shirt, and this holds true for all you guys. We're getting closer to starting up Barry. Came with a really, really small one. Costco for the win. We're gonna put that bad boy in, and then I think we're gonna start it, right? I told you I wasn't nervous, and now I am. Turn her over. Go ahead, turn it over until we build the oil pressure. I just leave the clutch down on the ground? Yes. That doesn't There's no plugs in it. Got some oil pressure. We are at 21. I don't know if you guys can hear Devin, but we're gonna put plugs in it and then we're gonna start her up officially. You guys, look at this setup in this car. By the way, it's super, super messy in here. These gauges, I just don't know if I like them over in this area. We might have to change that here shortly. All right, are you ready? Yes. Okay. That was so close. This is so white, you guys. I already want to do so many changes to this car, but I'm so happy it's alive. So that's gonna be a wrap for today. We got the car running. We still have to do some more fluidy stuff like bleeding the brakes, the Fuck clutch. Me. Actually, we're gonna pick that up tomorrow and we're gonna drive this thing on the street tomorrow, which I'm super excited about. So I will pick this video up in the morning. It's the next day, and I know this isn't car content related, but I'm gonna update you guys on my fitness stuff. So we're here in the grocery store, and I am in a caloric deficit for summer, so I'm losing some weight right now, and we're grocery shopping just a little bit because I need something to eat, like ASAP. My go-to is rice cakes, and the best ones are chocolate, but they don't got chocolate, so we're gonna do, we're gonna do caramel and white cheddar. Okay, and lastly, something I've been drinking a lot recently instead of diet soda because I've definitely told you guys to drink like diet soda when you're craving something. Since I've been paying more attention to like micronutrients, I've been drinking this a lot more. And these ingredients, instead of like additives and all these like unhealthy things, this has actual like root in it, which is kind of cool. So it's a lot healthier and it's all natural. Zero calorie too, root beer flavored. All right, and now we wait for Devin to come pick me back up.
Just letting you guys know, I'm a lot more lively than I was yesterday. I don't know what happened yesterday, but I was just in a really tired, sleepy mood. Today, I am beyond excited because we're gonna take this car for a ride. We're gonna drive it, and hopefully this will be my daily for a while. There's so much more to come with this Evo, you guys. Like, all last night, we were looking at Evo parts, wheels, tires, Varus kits, like... Uh, carbon fiber steering wheels like I'm so excited there's so much to do but the first thing we need to do is make sure it's running right and then we also have to see if we actually like this setup the turbo setup because we're used to ETS and I feel like I eventually want ETS but for now we'll see how I like this setup right now we're gonna bleed everything the clutch maybe the brakes and what else and then we'll get this gal on the road the worst part about bleeding a clutch let me show you guys is it sticks to the ground so i have to physically keep pulling it up and then to pump it you just push it back down and pull it up so i've got to do that a bunch of times while devin's adding in some fluid are you ready babe i wonder if i can just do it with my oh one eternity later ready to get going on the road you guys but look at how dirty this thing is so bad okay next thing we have to do before we get going out on the road is clean this up a little bit because the whole thing is a complete disaster I'm doing this right now I am leaving Gary in the shop and we're taking Barry home and I feel so bad I'm sorry Gary I'll be back for you someday but for now we're gonna drive my Evo and just see how she does I'm gonna daily drive it for maybe like a week or so hopefully do more stuff to it but for now we're just gonna say bye to Gary Last but not least today, we are going to actually be cleaning my Evo. So I don't know if I told you guys this, 
but I actually moved all my cleaning supplies for all the cars over to our home garage. I clean everything with Adams polishes, which I absolutely love. So I'm going to be cleaning the interior and the exterior. If you guys have followed Devin and I for years, you know that I've cleaned out a ton of cars that are like super, super bad. So this one's going to be pretty easy for me. And I actually really like doing it. So she looks so good parked next to the others. We're going to start with the inside. And this is kind of what the inside looks like. It's fairly clean. Seats are in such good condition. We just need to vacuum. It's a little dusty. She's been sitting a while. Other than that, you guys, she is really, really clean. I kind of want to show you guys my setup. So I ordered this Bissell vacuum. It's just mounted on the wall. I can vacuum any and all of these cars. I have my Adams stuff in here towels, utensils, buckets, along with all this stuff. And we also have the dryer right here. First things first, we're gonna do the inside. I'll show you guys what it looks like afterwards and then we'll get to the outside, which is honestly quite terrible. So let's get started. <laughs> Barry is looking so clean. The body on this car is like the best Evo 10 body I've ever seen. There's like nothing wrong with it. Wow, she cleaned up really, really well. So I'm not quite done yet. I actually am gonna clean the interior of Devin's BRZ right over there because I let my mom's dog inside and got dog hair everywhere. So I'm gonna clean that out. And then I still have to go to the gym and eat dinner and it's getting kind of late so i'm gonna try to bust out the brz and then i'll get back to you guys when i'm done it is late i don't not i do not know why but my eyes are like so red coda wait where are you there you are <laughs> when i get tired my eyes get really red but guys it's late it's like 12 o'clock at night we just got home from the gym and i am so exhausted but tomorrow we're gonna do more stuff to the evo it sounds like i think we're gonna finally put on the new taillights and the headlights so that will be in the next video remember hit the like button subscribe button and i'll see you guys in the next video bye